What's going on everybody, this is Pac-Man Jake with a really, really quick video on the announcement that Roger Goodell will announce the first round draft picks from his basement. That's right, you heard that right, he is going to announce the draft picks from his basement. With the first pick in the NFL draft, the Cincinnati Bengals select... So this should definitely be a really interesting draft this year, you guys. We all knew that it was going to be very different. My expectation was that things were going to be handled uh, in a manner that where announcement pickings were going to be, where Roger, where Roger would step up to a podium, probably preferably on the NFL building head, headquarters, and announce them there, whether he was going to have a small camera crew uh, being there, but there's of course there's also the possibility of there be doing it doing it through uh, a video conference uh, type of uh, platform instead of actually having a camera crew due to the technology that we have today. But apparently it's going to be done in his basement, so it's going to be very interesting. So obviously the NFL draft will be done completely virtually with coaches, GMs, and scouts all working at home. They'll be collaborating with one another probably via video chatting or over the phone or ever how they choose to operate this will definitely be this will hamper things a little bit i think and my i i just kind of see the communication being a little bit of a, a smallish problem it's kind of better to you know be there in the building to be able to have the best communication in my opinion so this will definitely be a really interesting draft, you guys. Something that I, we have never seen before in, especially in my years of watching the NFL draft. It's always been in a in a place, preferably. Uh, of course, all the, all the drafts that I've watched mostly were at uh, in New York at uh, Rayo City Music Hall, and then there was the uh, Jacob Javits Center, which is where they were held. Uh, in the 90s into the early 2000s. So this will definitely be a whole totally different type of feel. I expect this to be still relatively entertaining. I know that ESPN and NFL Network will team up together and they will simulcast together in the broadcast booth, which however that is going to work. The details of that have not been materialized so that's just all that I know. If anybody knows about anything a little bit more when it comes to how the broadcast situation is, you can uh, give me your thoughts and opinions in the comments, as well as you can uh, post uh, articles and such a way that just to educate the folks at home about how this NFL draft, pro draft process is going to work. And let's just say this is going to be very interesting, but at the same time, I think it's going to be a very fun NFL draft. And even though it's not going to be as electric or as much of a more of like a party atmosphere as we are accustomed to seeing. But again, I have plans to go live for the uh, NFL draft. However, it's going to turn out. We'll just see how things go and let's just uh, go with the flow and see how things are going to work in terms of having uh having fun with the NFL draft uh, come 10 days until uh, draft day. So I'll catch you guys later for another video.